Well, here we are at the Smart Energy Expo 2021, and I'm at the GE stand. And I know this inverter a little bit. You might notice, I'll probably put a link up here. Uh, I've actually done an unboxing on this, but I still don't know all the technical specs on it. So I've got a copy here uh, from GE, or, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about it. So um, what, what's special about this inverter? Uh, Glenn, I gotta tell you this. Uh, this is one of a kind in the, in the market. This is a large single phase hybrid inverter available in the market. Single phase? That's a single phase, yeah. How, how many kilowatts? So we have three ranges. It starts from five kilowatt, 8.6 and 10 kilowatt. And uh, it, it comes with a heaps of features. As you see the design and uh, yeah, it, you know, it, it, I can talk more about the features. So 10 kilowatt like single phase, it's a big That's inverter. Right. That's right, pretty much. I think this is the one of the, the biggest hybrid inverter available in the market. With Being the hybrid, it works with batteries. Uh, right. Are they low voltage batteries? Or? Uh, it's a high voltage batteries. Oh. Uh, already we are compatible with BYD high voltage batteries. Uh, pretty soon we'll be you know, doing that uh, integration with the other battery manufacturers as well. Right. Yeah. So as, as usual, you have to kind of make sure that your comms talk to their comms. That's right. Yeah. So I, I, I know that there's a few on the, on the data sheet like LG Chem. That's right. Uh, and the Goodby battery. The Goodby. Uh, recently Goodby is going to launch uh, you know, the low voltage batteries. Yes. But potentially they're going to launch the high voltage down the line. So as soon as they launch the Goodby high voltage, then yes, it will be compatible with this wonderful system, yeah. So it's got this extra box on here. What's this yeah. all about? Uh, this is the balance of system. Uh, you, you have all these built-in features goes into the system. Uh, as you can see that it comes with the built-in DC isolator as per the Australian standards. And also it has an AC isolator uh, inside that enclosure. Uh, and also you have the AC bypass switch. So everything goes under the system. Uh, and also it comes with uh, multiple trackers. Uh, yeah. You know, probably I can talk more about the trackers. How many trackers has it got? Uh, it has, uh, to start with the five kilowatt comes with three trackers and the 8.6 and 10 kilowatt comes with four trackers. Wow, that's four a lot, trackers, right? that is yeah. a lot for a, a 10 kilowatt inverter. That's right. That's so total yeah. flexibility yeah. about roof layout. That's exactly and, right. And module types, you could have different that's modules. That's right, you don't have to worry about the multiple orientations anymore. Yeah. So what gets me excited there is that you said a uh, DC isolator built in which yeah. is compliant with Amendment 2 of 5033. That's exactly So you don't need another box on the side. Nothing. What you need is just only the inverter. Every other single feature goes inside this box. So ideally, so you need the inverter and the battery, so no external accessories next to the inverters. I also like the fact that it's got a bypass switch. I mean, sometimes, right. you know, something doesn't go wrong, but you don't want to lose power to your backup that's, circuit. That's exactly So you can actually bypass the inverter with its own built-in switch. That's right. I mean, it's, it's, it's a very good uh, feature for the end customers. They don't really rely on the electrician in case if the, the inverter goes, you know, or dead or something. So simply you have a switch, bypass switch, just turn it on so it connects directly to the load and the grids are pretty much easy. Yeah. And the other things in the in the balance of system, you've got AC isolators yeah. um, and you've got, uh, so for your, your uh, EPS circuit yes. and for your grid circuit, yeah. anything else? Uh, pretty much, uh, yeah, I think the AC isolator, bypass switch, DC, and the, the battery isolator uh, and the AC isolator, that, oh, that's okay. pretty much, yeah. So you, you're really um, making the installer's job so easy. That's exactly right. That's the yeah. reason we have designed this unique system. So it's going to be, uh, saves a lot of time on the installation. Uh, it's going to be a quick installation and a neat installation. No external accessories next to the inverters, just the inverter and the battery. Makes it make very simple and neat, yeah. And it's this gorgeous sort of gold color too. Uh, yes, that's right. I really like this color personally, but um, yeah, I mean, this is a goldish champagne color, yeah. which actually gives a premium touch, yeah. which I think uh, most probably everyone likes it. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah. Great. Well, thanks very much for talking about it. And I think we'll just slide over and have a chat to Dean yeah. a bit about the whole range. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Glenn. Thanks for that. Uh, we are really happy about this new inverter that we launched this in the Smart Energy Conference. Uh, thanks for the unboxing video. And uh, hopefully we are looking towards the, the installation video of this inverter itself. You'll see the install video up here once I've produced it. Wonderful. So yeah, we're looking definitely getting close. No worries. Thank, Thank you, you so much for your time. Okay. Nice talking to bye. you. Yeah, bye. It's so it's good to be here, Dean, and standing at the GE uh, booth. Now, look, I've just done a little bit of a talk about the GE Hybrid Inverter, but one of the questions that people keep asking is, uh, so it, it's made by Goodwe, but it's a GE Inverter. What's that relationship? Yeah, it's a good question, Glenn. One we often get asked. So Goodwe is effectively a GE licensing partner. So what that means is that Goodwe do manufacture the product. Um, we design the product in conjunction with GE and uh, GE still have a lot of um, influence over the product, uh, marketing what we can and what we can't say. But we've got four series for GE, 
Um, so we've got a residential three to five kilowatt, we've got a three tracker single phase five to ten, we've got a commercial 29 to 36 um, uh, and a 50 and 60 kilowatt inverter. We've also got the hybrid that Goppy spoke about earlier and two of those series are specifically developed for GE from scratch and the other two series are effectively an adaptation of an original Goodwee inverter and we've uh, differentiated the product through um, features and specs and effectively tried to spec it up to uh, effectively make it a premium version of the Goodwee if you like. So the premium obviously from the, the, the champagne gold colour, um, is there any other features in terms of like warranty uh, uh, that changes that relationship? It does. So uh, in terms of the warranty, all the GE products come with a 10 year standard warranty. Um, and to give you an idea in terms of the features, if you take the 60 kilowatt GE inverter, um, for example, this has six MPPT trackers uh, compared to the Goodwee, which has four. It also has IV curve scan, so you've got your string monitoring. It's also got inbuilt DC isolators, um, DC covers, um, and, and we've just tried to, as I said, just really try and spec it up to a premium state. And I suppose the advantage for GE is it gives them an avenue into the residential, the commercial, and the storage markets globally. Um, and Goodwee, this gives us an avenue into the premium sector. Right. I can see it now. So basically, the GE inverter is built on the, the, the reputation and quality of Goodwee, but adding those extra premium features uh, to be a, a separate brand. Exactly right. So yeah, it is certainly a separate brand, and um, and we certainly think having the the 129 year history of GE, um, it's a powerful brand. It's one of the 100 most recognisable brands in the world. That we think that a lot of the installers and the retailers will find um, some value in that. Cool. Thanks, Dean. Thanks very much, Glenn.